rocking around the Christmas tree, everybody, even though it's the second day of third day of fall. Okay, so today I have the Super Snivy box, which releases in October, and I found it at my local Toys R Us early. Uh, some other pe some other YouTubers were finding it, them also. So they have the Super Snivy box, the Outstanding Oshawott box, and the Terrific Tepig box. And at Toys R Us, people were only finding Snivy. At Walmart, people were finding uh, at people's local Walmarts, they were finding uh, Oshawats, and at Target, they were finding like Tepigs. Uh, but like, so yeah. And wait, uh, I was going to get the Zoroark box. It's called Zoroark Master Evolutions. It's not the World Evolutions box. It's the Master Evolutions box. And we, it was the same thing, except it uh, had no figure, and this one does. But I found, like, since they didn't have, like, the price stickers out for them yet, because they shouldn't be out yet, uh, this one was actually $8 more. So, yeah. Okay. But, and I actually got the Zora Work one, but then I returned it. I didn't trade it out for this one. So, yeah. What this includes is it includes three packs of Emerging Powers. And the reason I returned the Zora Mark one is because it had two Emerging Powers and one Call of Legends. And I really did not want to open any Call of Legends. So, yeah. It has three Emerging Powers packs. A Snivy promo. Well, it's not really a promo. It's the same one from the black and white set, except it's holographic. The Snivy figure from the uh, tin. And then the main part is the 3D Snivy card, and it says Blanks Snivy. I'm obviously not going to put my name on it because that would ruin the value of the card. But yeah, it has uh, Snivy in all of its evolutions, and it's also 3D, so we'll see all about what's that. So we'll see what that's about. So yeah, let's get this box opened. And the Snivy figure is for trade. I'm going to try to call my way through this. But the Snivy figure is for trade because I already have one. Uh, I'd I like any of the two other figures. I already have the Victini figure. Obviously, it's in the background. But I would like either of the other figures or maybe a little different piece of Pokemon stuff. Or maybe Pokemon cards. So, yeah. Here's this stuff. Goes with all my other emerging power stuff. Yeah, it's all right there. So, yeah, let's get this thing open. So, yeah, it is definitely not for kids 8 and under. Even though a lot of kids 8 and under already probably have it. And don't even know that it's not supposed to be out yet. So, yes. Let us... Join us as we watch the messed up Star Trek series that I don't even like because I haven't even seen it. So yeah, it it the the figure's not in a nice little packaging. Oh wait, this might not be for trade because my other one's sort of broken. So yeah, I'm not gonna put this on right now if I can't get it on with this snap. Okay, I did. So you just. Just like that. So, yeah. I already have one, but it's broken, so that's why it's not in the background. Uh, uh, what happened to that? The small Snivy card. Oh, never mind. Uh, so yeah, here's the Snivy card. It's just a hollow version of the basic set card. And that is not for trade. And then, unlock your online rewards. This unlocks a booster pack, the promo Snivy, and it says also more. So yeah, this is put in very weirdly, the 3D jumbo card. Like you have to like pull it out of the slot. That's funny. Okay. So let's see what this 3D card is all about. So this is definitely way more glossy as you can see right there. And it's made out of like a thicker plastic material than the cardboard. And so here's the card, and you can see that 3D effect there, sort of. It's like the 3D that goes off the light. It makes, like, the background look like it's more into the picture, like the 3DS does. 
So yeah, that's a very cool card, and you can keep looking at it from right there. So yeah, very cool. And now on to our three packs of Emerging Powers. And we have a Cobalion pack, a Darmanitan pack, a pack, and a Tornadus pack. So let's start with the Tornadus pack. Okay, so the Tornadus pack. Sorry, I had to get new batteries for my camera. Even though it was just a small cut for you guys. Okay, so the code card. One, two, three, one, two. So we got Petalil, Deerling, Venipede, Emolga, Ducklet, Fair Thorn, I do not believe I have this one yet. Boldor, Lilligant, Petal Little Reverse Hollow, and a Gigalith. I only have the pre release version of this card, so it is not for trade. And I do not believe that I have the Reverse Hollow Petal Little, so I do not believe either of those are for trade. So, yeah, which one should I open next? I'm trying to save the best until last here. So, Cabalion. I heard it didn't jinx me. Okay, Emerging Powers packs open so funny. I mean, look at that. And some of them open really funny. Some of them open, like, normal. I mean, like, really. Look at how I pulled the plastic off that card. Uh, off that pack. Or plastic. Or what? What is it? Okay. So, code card. One, two, three. One, two. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Say, yeah, yeah. Say, yeah, yeah, duck. Okay, so we got Ducklet. Sawaddle. Mancino, Pansage, Purloin, Gotharita, Zorua, Crocorock, Reverse Hollow Goth Gothita, and I think this is for trade. Anna Lee Vanny, and this is also for trade. Okay, I better get something good out of this last pack. Because I need at least a hollow. Mainly one that I don't have. I don't care what it is, as long as I don't have it. Or I could get a Pokemon Catcher, that would be awesome. Yeah, that would be cool. One, two, three, one, two. And I know it's not on screen right now. Uh, Pan 4. Pan Sage. If that was a Pan Seer, that would be funny. Cub Chew. Uh, Patrat. Rufflet. Tranquil. Wimsmacot. Sharon. Wow. I thought that was the reverse holo Pokemon catcher. Man. Well, I didn't have that Wombs Macot, but the rare is. Mandibuzz. I don't have this one, but. That was like the worst pulls ever. Uh, I know Renee Collects did not get very good pulls either, and she got like, and I believe, I believe it was, um, whatchamacall, I believe it was, uh, Abby Roar, uh, I believe Abby Roar only got, I, mean, I believe Abby Roar got only, I, I believe Abby got five Bulldoors out of the three packs, or maybe that was Renee Collects. So, yeah, I got no Hollows. This Gigalith is not... Okay, let's see what new cards I got. Gigalith, Rare... I might already have that Ferrothorn, and I might actually have the Gigalith. I might have the Petalil Reverse, too. I did not have the Mandibuzz... I don't really care that much about it. And I did not have the Wimsmacot. I don't believe I have the... No, I, I do not believe I had this Cub Chew. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. And I am kind of disappointed. I mean, I got this from Toys R Us for $25. And the Zoro Bark one was only 16 For two Emerging Powers packs. A Call of Legends pack. A promo Zoroark, a jumbo 3D promo Zoroark. I think I might, 
Oh, should have gotten that one. I'm not sure. <laughs> 